Hey guys, it's JC Chandler back again. And I'm sorry it has been a while. I have been in troubleshooting mode. Um, since my last video, which was last Saturday, um, I have been trying to figure out some things. I've had some issues with my laser and I just, I'm just going to keep it transparent with you guys. I told you that when I started my, um, sublimation process, I was going to show you the good, bad, and the ugly. Well, let me just tell you what's been going on. And first of all, let me just say thank you to all the subscribers, all the new ones, all the ones that have been here since the beginning. And if you're watching the replay to all you future subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you for hitting play and hanging out with me. There's a few of you that reached out to me. I want to say a special thank you. You guys know that I don't go more than two days without posting a video and someone some of you reached out to me and was like hey i'm not seeing any notifications when do you go on and i'm like oh no <laughs> it's been a couple of days it's been too long period and i want to say thank you to the community y'all know if i'm not showing up call me out okay because at least every two days i'm i have been posting and i'm gonna tell you why i haven't been i've been trying to figure out some things with my laser cutter now you guys saw me do um a create along using these um these shapes and many of you reached out and a few of you even ordered and i have been having some difficulty cutting some of the shapes and some of the things that you guys have asked for there's been a multiple different issues um one i think is the wood that's number one but let me be real part of it is also user error me i um didn't clean my laser as good as i thought before and i want to show you what happens if you are getting a laser if you have a laser clean it clean it clean it uh hold on so these are the things that I was trying to work on. And here's a couple of things that's happening just in this picture right here. First of all, there's a lot of soot here. Now, I didn't put anything on the um, wood. Usually, I would mask it with some masking um, paper. Um, but I was trying to see what's going on. Like, something weird is happening. I cleaned out the laser. I thought I cleaned it out well prior to... Um, this week but I didn't so I went in opened it up you know it's not a hard process it just takes time um, and over by the fan the fan was not pulling out the smoke and it's still not so I'm still doing some research and finding out what's going on so laser work is on hold for now I have already been in contact with those of you who have ordered so thank you for your patience while I work on the issue um, so the what's happening is I'm getting a lot of smoke, I'm getting a lot of burning, and I have changed my settings, and there's just a lot going on. So this one cut, but, you know, there's a lot of soot. These did not cut all the way through. Like, this was done prior to the video. And then look what's happening. It's not cutting all the way through. Now... This happened several times, at least on three pieces of wood. And so this makes me say that after everything that I've done, and I'm still doing some troubleshooting, the batch of wood that I got is just bad. So now I got a, not bad, but I have to change my settings. The normal settings are not working. So that's one thing that's happening. Two, I didn't clean it as well as I could have before. So that I'm working on making sure that I don't do that again. That's a no-no. Um, I'm going to do a thorough cleaning every single time, regardless of the job. So that's number two. Three, the wood. I think I'm going to find another vendor. I've been getting it on Amazon, and for some reason, this wood is different. The whole batch seems to be bad. I did three of them and it wouldn't cut through and I've changed my settings. So I just don't know. Maybe it is the laser. I'm still working on it. And then, you know, finally, um, I just think that stuff like this, I don't know. I think the fan needs to be changed out. I'm also going to um, 
I have the Air Assist and the riser and so I'm gonna install that so over the next few days to week and some change maybe hopefully I'll get it done before my next Saturday live but I'm not gonna rush this because this is a an important piece of my business and I want to make sure that I get it right so laser cutting is on hold if I don't already have it cut and on anything that's on my site it's gonna have to wait just an FYI guys so I just wanted to put that out there and let you guys know this is the ugly part of um, the laser and it's not enough to deter me I'm not mad that this is happening this is actually a lesson that I need to learn early I haven't had it a year yet so I am learning um, but I'm going to get this corrected and I'll let you guys know what I finally find to be the issue whether it's me or the wood or whatever i'm going to come back and let you guys know because i know there's a lot of you thinking of getting lasers now i have the x tool m1 i am in love with it i have nothing bad to say about it i'm just trying to figure out some issues right now and i'm gonna go ahead and in this video i just wanted to pop on real quick um i have something else that i'm going to be um posting in another few minutes or a day or two or whatever um but again thank you guys for reaching out because jc usually i'm on every couple of days and reaching out to me warms my heart because you guys that means you're looking for me that means you care you know you've gotten used to seeing me post and that that makes me feel really really good you guys are amazing and i really appreciate you each and every one of you so more to come on the laser situation <laughs> and i'm hoping you are creating something amazing and i'll see you soon bye